the hell up. It's time for me to announce the newest member of ICW. ICW, it's dead! Introducing now, from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 190 pounds, the man. I'll sit here all day until you shut up. He is the man who defeated Jesse Neal, Jesse Sorensen, Lindsay Dorado, I'm louder than you are, Sam Shaw, Black Machismo, Jay Lethal. Wait a minute. He is not conceited, but convinced he will be a he will be accompanied to the ring by his new tag team partner, your girlfriend's favorite wrestler. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former, I, you know pro, Florida champion of title that he held for over 135 and a half days. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the five-star superstar accompanied by ERA, Max. Stardom! This is a bad show, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, I, I have looked at my partner, Mark Knowles, who has a complete look of shock on his face. At this moment, I guess I'll just drive the message next. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get back.
championship. You know I had a family emergency. How dare you? I wanted to be here. I was very excited to watch online as soon as I could. How is your sister sex change, by the way? Hey, how dare you, sir? That's private. Oh, right, I'm sorry. That was a text message you sent to me. I apologize. I don't text you. I don't like you. I'm the only reason you're booked in these shows. I look at your phone. No one's texting you. Vega getting it on to a hot start. Clobber in the ring and Max Stardom. And Max is already trying to leave. He's already trying to escape Vega. By the, by the hour here? You don't want to get stay here. the same thing. Whether you win in 30 seconds or 30 minutes, Stardom knows that. Stardom is definitely no stranger to using a cheap way of winning. You say cheap, I say effective. I say he's trying to end this match as soon as he can. And not have a real actually athletic contest with a guy like Vega. It doesn't matter how athletic it is. This is wrestling. Some of the best wrestling I've ever seen was down. Absolutely. Rolling kick by stardom to the temple of Vega. We can very well see Vegas title being cut short. Starting to regain that title here tonight. Yeah. And now the score for French by Stardom. Looks like he's going to get it. He didn't get all around the world that time. They are using his strength to bring him up. And drop him down. The, the amount of people that have fallen to that move where they've gotten their head fast into the ring is insane. It is astounding right there. Eli Vega. Eli Vega. Eli Vega. To counter that shows the fortitude of the Florida Heavyweight It also shows how well Vega knows stardom after a classic match with him last month and just being the smart guy. Come on. I know it's no DQ because it's cage matches, but EA obviously taking advantage of that. Stopping down from getting over the top. This just shows the partnership. Eli Vega and as to wrestle against three men. You have all these men on one side. You gotta keep your eyes and your ears open at all times. Big head scissors from the top rope. Starting to around and people that used to admire him, people that used to respect him here in Nino Pro. After a change of heart last month, that's now over. Back started, looks like he's trying to escape now. I don't know he's escaping, he's distracted by the fans, but now it looks like he's got his eyes back. And Vega has got a plan. Oh, that spear! But plans do change. And Vega catches him with a spear. I hate to say that Stardom was wrong. But if, for instance, he may have planned something and it might not have worked out properly in his favor. You know what is working out though? The new nickname of Five Star Sellout. Let's put that on a t shirt. Max Stardom's own personal cheerleader, ERA, failing an attempt to get a max chance started. Forum shot by Eli. It's not a cheerleader if you're actually invested in it. They're invested in friendship. I mean, they're one hell of a tag team now. They're out of the state of Florida. Absolutely, up and down the state from all the way from Key West to WXW. Absolutely, you see there, Sardom getting a job. Sardom giving a job. Each man trying to get the better. Spin kick. Takes out the knee now. He's... He was going for a kick, and once again, Ace Cutter by Vega. We've seen him defeat people with that before. 
It's time to be one of them now. Two, maybe a two and a half. But stardom not down quite yet. Only a two count for Bruce Owens. And it looks like now that didn't work out. So you have to rearrange his thoughts here and go into the lead. Once again, Vega maybe going to win with his game in the cage. And once again, Era, ERA stopping him. Starting with a look of shock. I'm sharing a very similar expression. Going back to the rival for the school. School breaker, let's call it. Stardom saw an opportunity, he took it. He's attempting to take one now. Scorpio even looking to assist Stardom. And Scorpio told Stardom to look out for Vega as he was behind him. The fact that Vega is able to make it back to his feet, the fact that Vega is standing right now, shows the testament to this man. Shows that he is willing this to win and how he got to where he is. It also shows how important this Florida championship is to a man like Vega who fought so hard to get it. And such a big suplex with a pain on Stardom's face. Oh, this is Thomas Vega, that's a good idea now. We get a chance to let Vega sit down for a few minutes. He needs that. That's exactly what he was doing. That big man guy with Vega there. What did that pretty thing do with that chair? He wanted to give Max Ryan a taste of something. No, Vega being the bigger man, not using the chair. Or maybe he's just looking for a better opportunity. Stardom got out of it. Kick to the midsection. Is he gonna go? What a dirty opportunity that was. Ice pressure on the steel chair. The heinous attack there by Vega. Vega using a weapon that he did not introduce, but he just used to his advantage. You don't know what that chair was intended for originally. Yeah, everyone knows. Blind people know. Yara and Stardom were trying very hard. And Yara is trying to super kick Eli Vega. Come on. He just did super kick Eli Vega. And that's what he gets for using that chair. Well, Stardom has a chair now. I don't think he's going to ask Vega to sit down. I think he's going to use it. I would be very upset with Vega. Taking retaliation is in order. Whatever you say, Dan Vega now. About to turn around the world of hurt. And the mush of Eli Vega is now. Wait a minute. So I'm climbing. Vega's in the the door. Wait a minute, maybe now though, referee Bruce Owens, the DJ's battle was Vega, but Bruce is saying maybe it's Max. The referee has no idea. I have no idea. 
was very close. You might have to look at this as a replay here. I'm trying to see both angles of this on the monitor. I'm not quite sure. Chris has the title. Is he? He's awarding it to Vega. He's making a judgment call and he's saying Vega's feet touch the floor first. And Vega has retained the Florida Championship. Thank <laughs> you. 